the composite function. We're going to solve initially the inside of this equation, the inverse cosine of negative 3 over 2. The bounds of cosine are from 0 to pi. And because of that, this is the same, this is writing out the same thing as negative root 3 over 2. Bounds between 0 and pi, that means that we can only choose the values between that, and the only place where cosine of x is equal to negative root 3 over 2 is equal to, in this case, 5 pi over 6. So you're going to take the tangent of 5 pi over 6. If you draw a unit circle here, 5, or 5 pi over 6 is roughly here, and it's opposite over adjacent. This is a 30-60-90 triangle. y is equal to 1, so it's y over x. y is equal to 1, and x is equal to root 3. So the result here is going to be equal to 5 pi over 6. It's going to be equal to 1 over root 3. Excuse me, 1 over, it's going to be negative 1 over root 3 because uh, x is negative in this direction. And if you need to get rid of the radicals, it's simply going to be negative root 3 over 3.